the Hoop TV oh, yes. back in your high school days. Oh, okay. All right? All right. Right here, Steve. Now, go back one or two, three years, Portland Legends, SCA, your high school kids. Did you ever think that then you'd be some, one day trying to play for uh, Team USA? Uh, I always kind of had it in my mind. Uh, I think uh, back in high school, you know, I was kind of a snot-nosed kid, didn't know what to think. But uh, you know, I kind of worked my way up, kept working hard. Um, so, you know, I had good people around me, and the fact that I'm here now is all you know, a testament to that. I saw you years ago playing as I don't know, 14, 15 year old at the uh, Memorial Day Classic in New Orleans. And I said to you then, you were the most fundamentally sound kid I'd seen play. Right. And then I saw Maurice Lucas on the bench with you. I said to myself, well, he got to be fundamentally sound because I know Mo's going to teach him right. right. How important was that experience playing at that level with that caliber of player? Oh, it's huge. And, uh, you know, just to learn from, you know, players like himself and, you know, my father as well. Um, you know, I think it was big for me. And, you know, that's what, uh, you know, USA Basketball is looking for. And that's what a lot of teams are working for as well. Just fundamentally, fundamentally sound, big man that can do everything out there on the court. You played out here in the, uh, in the Reebok, in the big time, in the Reebok championships, main event, events like that. Give me your most memorable games you played in here in the summer in Vegas against some of your fellow NBA players now within high school. Um, I definitely have to say uh, uh, the end of summer classic or whatever the big one was right. for Reebok. Right. Uh, my senior year when we played, you know, Derrick Rose, Eric Gordon. Uh, we played a bunch of other NBA guys that are here today, OJ included. Um, I think that was probably my most memorable moment because, you know, those are the guys I'm playing with right now. You had a young kid at the time, Brandon Jennings, I remember, is about a 10th grader getting you the right. ball then. Uh, he's in the NBA now. He's younger than you. What would you tell him now that he's here? Uh, keep his mouth shut right now. Uh, <laughs> no, he knows that. We're good friends. Uh, no, he's heard that enough. But, you know, he's going to keep continuing to grow. The game's going to slow down for him a little bit, and he's going to be fine. Um, right. Right. I think he's going to step into a situation where he's going to be able to learn a lot under Scott Styles and great coach, a great uh, system. So uh, I think he's going to be well up. Great.